<laughs> Sorry, we had an audio issue uh, due to the controller. I don't know why it happens, but it happens. I appreciate all 11 of you guys coming in here and watching. We really appreciate you seeing this. It's super fun. I know that that school wanted to come back out. The school, they're like two hours from here. They came out last time, brought like 20 kids. It was super packed, really fun. They couldn't make it because their, uh, their coach was actually out of town, but they are going to be at the next tournament. So, but yeah, let's go, go ahead and get into this. Seeing Realist is out here pushing that center. He wants to take a good spot. 238, beautiful hits. Bubbles coming out. Oh, that's what I was trying to say earlier. The I feel personally the Arc Star is the biggest asset to counter Gibby. Just because you have that ability to stick the bubble. So if you have patience in Arc Stars, you can counter that bubble. Especially if they don't know about it. Um, for those of you who don't know, you can actually stick the bubble and then as long as you time it so that the bubble is going down before the arc star is going to explode, you can get that arc star to drop straight down from where you stuck it on the bubble. Oh, crack on the Gibby. That was big. We actually have two Gibbies out right now. Actually, they're running the exact... No, 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 no. Realist trying to get that Phoenix kit off. That's a interesting decision. Very interesting decision. I don't typically... I wouldn't be that close and run a Phoenix kit, but hey, to each their own. There are just some daredevils out here. Seeing a little bit of pre-match parkour. Got to loosen up. Get the wall bounces ready. You already know. You know the vibes. Let's check out the other team. Realist and Snowster. A little more calm. Snowster. Right up on that wall. He's ready. He is ready. He is ready. Realist looking for the center. You can see. I don't know. If he, he only has one scan. So he actually didn't buy an extra scan. Um. If they're confident that they're not going to be going to first or second ring closing, then, you know, like, like like he just did, you can go ahead and get that scan out the way. But looking to connect, not quite connecting, taking a lot of damage there. I'm going to go ahead and reset with the bat. See who's in the action right now. He's hard watching that pill, but it's not connecting any of those shots. Ooh. Big crack, big crack on Bang. QT is just connecting with those wingman shots. That is my alarm to get out of here, but I am hoping to watch the rest of this match. We're going to safely abide by the speed limit on the way to work, but I will be watching the rest of this match. So hopefully we get a... Don't get too too long of a drawn out match. They have ring on their backs. Mm. Mm. What we do? What we doing here? I'm confused. Where are my people? Snowster healing back up again. He really used his scan really early on. It looks like he ran out of bats as well. Or not bat cells. So he had to use a bat for only, you know, a notch and a half of healing. But it's still necessary. Snowster healing up. QT's connecting with these wingman shots right now. Ooh, got a knock. QT with a knock. <laughs> he was struggling there for a second. He, he, he's out of bubbles. He's out of bubbles. This is... Snowster wins these. Honestly, if he would have choked out there, um, I don't know why he was punching the wall. Probably just a misinput, but if he wouldn't have punched out that wall, he probably would have won that. 
But that's why you have to stay calm. You have to be calm. You cannot panic here. Because, especially in a duo, as I was just talking to another team, you need to be on point with your duo partner. This is not like trios. Trios, whether it's arenas or, well, they don't have duos in arenas, but if you squad up for a three-man, you can usually find three people that are playing solo and they'll mesh pretty well. But running duos, you're way more likely to run into somebody who does duos regularly. And with duos being the way they are compared to trios, you get way more aggressive play style from these people because if you knock somebody, there's no chance of getting 2v1 in duos. If you get a knock, you can you can at least bare minimum you're getting a 1v1. Possibly a 2v1 if your teammate comes with you, whereas on a trio match, if you knock somebody, it doesn't guarantee that there's going to be only one guy there when you push. They're pretty far apart right now. Honestly, if they could isolate one of these people, they could they they could get a knock. Cuz there's a, there's enough space in between Snowster and his teammate. Oh no, no, no. I'm, I apologize. Between QT and his teammate that they could have they could have naded, try to separate the two a little bit more, came in, pushed one and then turned around. That's kind of the best play here. You're really just looking for duos, especially in arenas here, is just really looking for that player that is isolating themselves and hitting those shots. If you can hit those shots and get somebody by themselves, it's really an easy fight. It's not that difficult. Um, of course, you know, everybody's playing slow. Um, who's this? Vanny? Vanny? Yo, Vanny. Bubble's coming out. That's a knock on blood. He's got to play that bubble. It's easy for him all day. Easy for him all day. I think that's going to be 1-2. Alright, I can't put it off anymore. I have to go to work. Appreciate you guys showing up. Really, really, really appreciate you guys showing up. Appreciate it talking to you again. One more shout out to EA. Make sure you're checking out the ALGS. They're going out. I want to say they're going on right now. Um, next time they run a tournament, I will make sure I have that. I will make sure I have that information for you. Unfortunately, I was up all night editing the beautiful B-roll that we see in between each match. Really proud of it. Um, but I had to get that done, so I didn't quite have all the information I wanted. But ALGS, appreciate EA for the codes. Love to see it. We really enjoy having these tournaments. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and check out. Check out this area. Watching this. Let's go this way. Target spotted. 